This video is brought to you by Squarespace. Dude, I swear this monitor frame legs or something. I just can't keep up with these players, man. Are you sure you're not just bad? <laughs> You're using the 240Hz monitor to watch cat videos. I bet if I had a monitor like that, I could do 10 times better than this. All right, I'll take you up on that offer, Jason. Let's see what we can find. This Jason guy, he thinks he thinks the gear makes the player. All right, I'll get him the best one right now. All right, apparently this is the legendary one. Let's get this one in for him. Four to six weeks later. Yo, Jason, check out what I got for you today. Dude, the last time we had a cloth over something for an unwrap, we had a sick monitor, so this better be it. Oh, <laughs> we got something good for you. All right, let's unwrap. Okay, we got a sweet monitor, but it's uh, disassembled though. Today we have the BenQ Zowie XL 2546 240 Hz gaming monitor, Jason. This monitor has a refresh rate similar to the Alienware one, and the company themselves boast that it delivers a buttery smooth gameplay. They also have a special dynamic accuracy technology inside to keep their picture quality smooth and consistent. All right, well, you gotta help me build this thing, man. All right, so we got some power cables, and we got our own BenQ monitor guideline stuff. I can tell you're excited for the goodies, so what do you think those are right there? These? I don't know what they are. I'm assuming they go on the side of the monitor though. Okay, so it clips on. Sweet, okay, there's one side. Good. This monitor looks sweet, man. But like, what are these flaps on the side? All right, so those flaps are actually called shield blocks. They're actually removable and adjustable. It helps you avoid outside distractions from your peripheral vision, so you can actually just focus straight on your game. All right, I noticed that we have this like remote control looking thing here. Does it go for the monitor as well? So there's actually a little dip in the monitor stand over there at the bottom, and that fits right in there. It is called the S switch. It's a switch that allows you to easily access the monitor menu and switch between different modes, whether it be FPS, RTS, RPG, or MOBA, as well between connected devices. Damn, this little can do all that. You know, sometimes I found it pretty hard to reach for the monitor and switch through modes, so this could be a really great alternative. You just gotta reach over and press it like a mouse button. So I got you this monitor for one particular reason. Can you really game better with this? Do you think a 240Hz refresh rate really helps you improve your gameplay? You did bet that you'd play 10 times better with it. There's only one way to find out. To the test station. All right, so I gotta be honest with you guys. Having a 240Hz gaming monitor is great and all, but on a scale of zero to 240, this thing kinda 240 hurts me in the wallet. <laughs> and that's why I'm starting my own online store to sell the thickest and juiciest pickles in the nation. That's right, with the help of Squarespace's dynamic all-in-one platform, I became a pickle pioneer. In search of pickle perfection, we tried everything we could from the highest quality of ingredients to making the best looking storefront. That's why we made use of their award-winning designer templates to help us stand out. As a new pickle on the block, you really gotta make a good first impression. Check out the shop, we got some pickled gingers, pickled carrots and daikons. What the hell, we even pickled a lemon. For you Korean gamers out there, we have a super special blend of cabbage, chili, scallion, radish, and garlic, but I'm sure you know what that's called. If you ever find yourself in a pickle, don't worry. You can easily get customer support through email or online chat at any given time. Now you'll be selling pickles like hotcakes 24-7. So make sure to check out squarespace.com for a free trial. And when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash unwrap to save 10% off on your first purchase. Oh, right. Wait, it actually is like brighter though, right? Like, damn. I've never used this monitor before, but I can tell that it is a bit brighter. But I'm pretty sure this is due to their special feature here. They call it the black equalizer. The best way to describe it to you guys is like, it's as if you opened your eyes. This is what it look game looks like normally. It's very dark. It's uh, very sad almost. Okay, I'm gonna maximize it. Oh no. Dude, it's like, it's so bright. There you go. Yeah. So you turned up shadows to very high and you get a black equalizer. Let's see. <laughs> wow, dude. Like all the characters look so detailed now. Like, is this like also a 4K monitor or is it just supposed to be this detailed or something? Now this is not a 4K resolution monitor, but the monitor does feature 1920 by 1080 full HD resolution. So it's supposed to show the game in razor sharp detail, but it's not quite 4K yet. What do you think of the height and the angle of the monitor, Jason? I mean, right now I have it like right in the middle, so it's nice, but I also noticed like you can easily move it up and down just like that. And it can actually go vertical, I believe. Let's just try playing like this, right? This is an experience in itself. <laughs> 
the 240 hertz does get a lot of praise from people but do you want to really put it to the test let's do it how exactly is it possible to showcase 240 hertz when youtube only allows a max of 60 fps and even if youtube allowed 240 fps most of you guys at home are probably watching this from your 60 hertz monitors either way we have a problem we're going to show you a simulation using test ufo this website automatically detects your refresh rate your current fps and adjusts the animation accordingly at normal speed all three ufo probably look the same that's because regardless of 120 or 240 what you're watching is capped at 60 fps how about we try slowing down the footage by 50 percent little bit of stuttering in the last row but the first two are still smooth let's slow it down even more to 25 percent 240 fps is still smooth because 25 percent of 240 is 60. now on the other hand the 60 becomes a nice laggy 15 fps okay you won't ever play a game at 15 fps but the point is this is how much more visual information you are gaining from 240 hertz now try to imagine that at regular speed it's a real smooth gaming experience okay jason this is the moment of truth you did claim that you would play 10 times better if you first bought this so let's go a monitor like this deserves more than cat videos oh no <laughs> oh you want to go black yeah we can do it. oh he doesn't know oh he knows I oh died. no oh no oh no hey here's a bad joke you don't want to put in the video <laughs> okay no. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, what do those drones do? Do they give you stuff? This is where you really test that 240Hz. Can you hit those guys, Jason? I only have an SMG. No excuses. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you jump on this drone? No. Oh, shoot. Oh, my. <laughs> I can tell you confidently, normally you would have lagged right there. <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> you died anyway, I guess. Okay, I'm coming. Oh. Yeah, I don't think oh. you can <laughs> <laughs> Pair of dice palms. Pair of these palms. Wow, you still think people that use side buttons were weird? I converted to using it and now I'm just, I cannot play without it anyway. It's like converting to 240 hertz. I know, right? You literally can't go back. It would honestly 240 hurt me to go back. <laughs> oh no. Wait, what the heck is that guy doing up there? <laughs> Hit 115. Okay. My banana slipped past me. We didn't have the banana equalizer, he was too strong. Hey, okay, at least you had some good League of Legends gameplay. <laughs> We're gonna get some good gameplay here. Right here. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh. Yo, oh, let's dude. go. Nice. We did it. <laughs> With two 240 hertz monitors, victory is easy peasy. Oh, we opened this bad boy. What do you think I'm getting, Jason? Call, call me out. Look at this. TV Bison Night Rust. What? Oh man, if we get a knife unboxing, that'd be great. Oh, this one's a glove, but I'm down. Why is this one of the red skins? Here we go. Don't try this at home. Hey, we got a revolver. Okay, yes. A Dust 2 competitive. Dust 2? I can't believe it. We waited all this time for Dust 2. Damn, how's that? Oh, look at buttery smooth. What's smoother than butter? 240 shot? There you go, buddy. Oh, shit. How did I hit these? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. It never ends. Oh. My <gasps> oh. Wait, we don't have a team anymore. It's 3v5. I'm gonna jump on you real quick. Oh, he's lit. That's two. Oh my goodness, dude. It went from 5v5 to 3v3 to, to 3v5, and now it's 5v3. Okay, 1 HP. Oh, oh, this guy there. He says all B. Hell no. Nah. I'm gonna go A. Oh, did actually B? <laughs> oh no. How could I be so foolish? Oh, boys. There's three of us, please, all together. Come on. <laughs> oh my god. No, no. <laughs> what the uh, heck? It hurts. Oh, the guy abandoned the game. We have a chance. Oh shit, I'm sorry. <laughs> Goggles is checking us out. Looks like your products aren't working. Oh my god. <laughs> 
There's no way this is happening. We call him an Indian. Hey, you're insane. You have 31 kills. These guys are rich. Please. Perfect. All right, we're closing this game. <laughs> the guy said you toggled. Let's <laughs> go. Oh my god, I killed him flashbang. Nice. All right, so Jason, what are your final thoughts on that XL2546 monitor? Did it live up to your expectations for the better monitor? And did it make you play 10 times better? I said it before and I'll say it again. Like the refresh rate, the 240 hertz, it's something you need to try at least once in your life. 60 hertz is like riding a bike with training wheels on. 240 hertz is when you take them off and it's like just totally different, you know? And that's it for us. We're out. Let's call it a wrap. As always, links are in the description below if you want to go chat the monitor for yourself.